Hello everyone, and welcome back to my show. It's Wib. Back on Epic 7. Oh, another Guild Wars video. Today is Monday, so. Yep. I thought today was the reset for Guild Wars. I thought we were entering the new season, but apparently I was wrong. Maybe it's next week or something. But uh, I definitely did reset. We are in the new season, there is already the new gear and stuff. Oh, it was running to start off. Nice. So we're at war against. Kaizokudan, uh, th those seem there are a low amount of members in the guild, but I guess we'll see if we can hit all to effort. Alright, first fight I guess Rotro World? Uh, Rose World? I don't know, really know. But yeah, he's just, he's just cleaving, so I guess we're gonna hang out with uh, pretty much anything on Tai Cleave right now. Uh, probably he doesn't have artifact again, probably just a girl. Let me switch that really quickly. Alright, let's go. I put silver run instead of polities because I was tired every time of switching artifacts. So this goes first, perfect. We got a counter with both MLK and on Edward. Oh well no not Edward because I don't think any debuff landed. Yep, <laughs> no debuff landed on Edward, okay. <laughs> Guess this goes well for, for our first one. Oh well I guess Telibetzo did have enough debuff to cut. So we even cut the Celias. So let's see, do we get the reset? We didn't get it on uh, air, but ooh, well I guess he's dead. <laughs> Goodbye Obsig. Could have go pretty wrong right here, but... Yeah, I think if, if the Cilias had quitted us and we had counter the Cilias instead of the Obsig, maybe it would have resulted in MLK dead, but... Yep. I mean... Yeah, no, 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 cleaving in defense seems kinda hard. <laughs> With how many options there is to anti cleave. But yeah, in both his defense, I could have used both time Edward, and I would have pretty much already won. Because <laughs> by doing that, and. Can you create? So it's just. Okay, no. Make it. Thank you, Daily Bets. I have really geared my Daily Bets, and I think uh, I get a pretty decent. I just need to really fog it all. But yeah, I really like. But no, uh, I also need to <laughs> 6 star awakening, but the problem is that she has exactly the same catalyst as MLY, so it's kinda tough. <laughs> okay, so this goes first, we get this, so we get skill null, so STN is pretty much not going to do anything. If he survives, because <laughs> right here we're gonna get this, and yeah, this goes STN, so it's dead. Goodbye STN, put this goes. Oh, it's uh, guiding light setting. Okay. Uh, let's just soul burn. It's not like we we, we need the soul burn on politics. Yep. We land the blind though. On the rose. It's not every time you see a rose <laughs> too. I just noticed. But yeah. I mean, it doesn't change the fact that yeah, it's uh, it was an easy setting game right here. Oh, but this is still on Bruiser build. Uh, I mean, show. honestly, <laughs> I will probably need to change it. It doesn't do much, but How naive. yeah, it doesn't even, even have uh, yeah, it doesn't even have ER yeah. or anything. Oh, I guess dual attack everywhere. Well, um, can I push you back? No, Help. doesn't seem like I can. Uh, can we bonk her, rest. please? Okay, not enough. So I guess my police might die before the end of this fight. Uh, do you have skill 2 or anything? Oh, you have still skill 1, so yeah. Let's just see 2 for damage. Battlefield's protector. Oh, well, I guess anyway he got cleans. Oh, well, I guess this is perfect, actually. <laughs> yeah. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, okay. and we sl oh, we slept, so are we guaranteed to crit right here or can we still miss? Okay, we can still miss, oh, yeah. Because uh, Slips guarantee crit, but it doesn't guarantee it. Which would be uh, kind of fun. I mean, <laughs> there's already enough st 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 thing to put a reversion unit. Let's not add one. <laughs> oh, I guess we stun right here. This one is really tanky, by the way. I mean, you don't uh, have only Selene as damage, but still. It's too late to say sorry. Which impressive. Yeah. Yep. Well, tanky on quite some speed. Still. But yeah. This is the end right here, so we go already on the second fight. Alright, definitely this game doesn't have the best defense in the world, but I guess we'll go against this second fight, Sandan. 
So the second team we're gonna cleave on first I guess we are gonna cleave this cleave. I mean uh, honestly I don't really know what Kawaii does. I think he does skill two first turn, which he'll do it on either Yufin which can evade on Celias which well it does not matter if he does it on Celias. And he can reset us, I think, but uh, as long as he doesn't reset you, I think we're fine. Depends on the, this Landy on Strazes and behind. On the bottom team, I, I mean, even if there is Moonlight Tarion, if I remember, Moonlight Tarion can cleanse only once. So he can't cleanse the bomb on Caesaria. So I guess we'll see. Maybe this Eta win with <laughs> Vildred Input is gonna outspeed us, maybe. <laughs> Hope will be quite an interesting sight. Um, okay, I guess we outspeed right here. Give all that you uh, who's right behind you? I need to check so I can maybe pop them back or anything. Come. Um, it's Landy actually, so I guess provoke the Landy because it's nice. So he doesn't skip three even if he gets a turn. But yeah, right here we go with attack buff. Uh, he says going to take the turn actually. Yes, I think. I won't say no to that. So that still my says on life steal. That's not like a cliff says or anything. Face me. So. Yeah, it's still a bruiser says. I think the Slazer is gonna die from the Sher Damage, so... I mean, not Sher Damage, but you get what I mean. So let's go, go and kill the Kawaii instead. Hop. So yeah, it's not a cleave one, so as you can see... I mean, hey, 22 with attack buff on Ziggur, I guess. Well, oh, <laughs> it killed everyone! <laughs> 10 km! Despite being a lifesteal build, does pretty decent damage. Kinda slow, but... It's a nice deal. And hey, it's uh, decently fast. Hey, I win. But not fast enough. I always uh, give my own. If you won't step back, this is going to be a quick reroll. Well. <laughs> your justice into Between, uh, We're only cleaving or anti cleaving. <sighs> no, so yeah, as you can see, I turn in passive already proc, so. We just have to not sit him anymore. Or, um, let's give the build back. Are we gonna get countered by this spell? No, it doesn't seem like it. Can he cleanse right now? I don't I don't think he can. If I remember correctly, he can only cleanse one per turn. Unless they buffed him at some point. No, oh, yeah. As you can see, he can only counter one. I can cleanse one. So, up, boss bomb going to go right here. Oh, they're not even going to skip three right here. Yeah, I want the Tywin to take a turn. So he wastes his turn. We kill him right here. And if he's only sack, he doesn't really matter. Oh, but I guess we didn't kill him. Kill him, please. And he wasn't even only sack, so I guess yeah, this is over. I pulled my weight. All right, and I guess this will be a very fast guild war against Sanal Riven. The last fight on yeah, last fight on it's also kind of cleave. So we're gonna go back with Edward and Amelkan to kind of kill everything right here. And then bottom team, Millim is just here for the book honestly, uh, but I guess he can kill something since Caesar will most likely only kill three two targets. But I guess we'll see. So first one already goes, so it's the door that goes. I could have actually put Selin instead of um, FCC, but I wanted FCC because I want. I'm not sure if Tiswin can maybe kill uh, Melken. Okay, at least we resisted everything. So this goes. Or we remove Skinner, which is nice. This goes also. They have immunity, so it's kind of annoying, but I guess we strip the, the Tiswin by doing that. But he's going to get Puck if I remember correctly. Goblet of Oath. Yeah, he's going to get Puck, and with the Scott, he's not going to die, Heed even if I eat her. So we're gonna have to tank this Tissuin, and this uh, PR has enough effectiveness to debuff my Melkan, which is kinda worrying. No but he could go on Melkan. <laughs> Woo! And you see, guys, that's why I took FCC. <laughs> I think it'll end soon. Yep, that's why I took FC uh, FCC. I would have died right here without FCC. <laughs> okay, I guess this one is... And I'm silence. Uh, shit. This is um, yeah, let's just do this uh, to negate a bit of the damage. At least on Edward. Or maybe we can. No, we're not killing Tissoin with that. Yep. But oh well, we're killing Tissoin with that though. So yeah, I guess. Hey. But yeah, I did. I did well by putting FCC. I think. Selene would have like jumped into Tissuin on, on. Like it would have interchanged uh, a lot. Yeah, I think we would have died with Selene actually. So yeah, FCC was the right choice. And why did she attack FCC by the way? Is she counter? I didn't. She's right now on Lucilla, okay. Okay. <laughs> I thought she didn't debuff Edward again. <laughs> like first sight. Okay. 
Ok. <rire> ok, Payora. <rire> get, get Edward. Ouf, on est bonne quicks. Goodbye, Kitty. Oh, oh, she was not a lot of defense on that Payora, I think. On the end of the last one, I guess it could be a pretty easy cleave, especially since Worker is gonna ignore ER this BBK, so even if he has a lot of ER, it doesn't matter. I could maybe put my uh, run on Silver Rain. I think I have a Silver Rain, no. I could maybe put him on Silver Rain. But, I mean, I still need to level it up. <laughs> and, yeah, I guess Milim will really be useless. Okay, I guess. <laughs> yep. Minimum will see for the book. Oh, yeah. Hey, that was a clean guild wall for a Monday. Nice and easy. Boop. Anyway guys, that was it for this quick guild wall, I guess. Yeah, very easy one. We just pretty much cleave or anti-cleave everything here. And yeah, I guess if you want to see my gear as usual, you can just ask me and I'll post it in the community tab. Uh, but what's other that? Yeah, I guess we'll see each other next time. Bye. Got a soul. We never took another summer cold.